just before this video starts, I would like to say that this video was intended to be a joke. I don't mean to offend anybody. And yeah, so please enjoy the video. Why do some people just sit there in your tribe and never level up? Ethereal monsters are so hard to get because they are worth so many diamonds. Why are all the members of the sugar fam so expensive even when there's a sale? I know nobody likes dipsters, but why are they worth 7 keys on Ethereal Island? It makes no sense. The trades in this game are so unfair. Literally, why do I have to get 50 diamonds for 100 shards? I have two questions. One, what were they going for here? And two, why does this thing look so sad and ugly? The spin the wheel mechanic is so rigged. Here, just look at this footage. I was literally a centimeter away from the chest and all I got was 20,000 coins. That's so bad. Why are some wobblings so hard to get? Like, really? Why are these islands so expensive? Ah! Why are relics so hard to get? Why does the sugar fan take so long to breed? Like, come on, game. Why can we dislike islands? That's so messed up. The in-app purchases are so stupid. Literally, why would I pay a hundred bucks for three million food? Why are ethereal so expensive? I know this is a good thing, but why is Rare Wobox so cheap? Like, I would expect him to be, like, worth more star power, because it's a Wobox. I know I've said this before, but why the frick are Celestials worth so many DIAMONDS? Once you have over 150 million coins, there's not really much to do with them, except for buying food and decorations. Diffuser and Globes are useless. Literally, all they do is sit there on your island. And for the final reason, why are there so many My Singing Monsters feet pics? Like, what the fuck? Thank you guys for watching the video. If you want, you can like, comment, and subscribe. And my friend code is at the end of the video. Anyway, bye.